she asks, so even if I don't feel life owes me, if I have a disturbance, then it means that somewhere I'm holding a feeling of being owed? Yes, Lisa, 100%. How can I, how can I feel like I got shortchanged unless I didn't get the money I expected? Sorry for the metaphor, but you get the point. Yeah, that's exactly right, Lisa. We're always, we always have, it's so weird too. When you think about how fortunate we are, as most of us are as Westerners or whatever country we live with, and, we're in, and we have enough food and, and clothing and stuff, yeah, I, I, how, how often are you grateful? Gratitude should be, a, should be, and I don't mean that we should imagine it, but gratitude should be something that moves through us at the same time that love reconciles these disturbances. I'm grateful to be alive. I'm grateful to be to be the instrument of this life, of this love. Not I'm grateful because of what I have. That's beautiful. We often share our gratitude for the for the bounty of our lives. That's appropriate. But the real gratitude is in the relationship that is being given to us by grace, by which we can see we are given everything that we need before we ask it and that nothing is taken from us, that we aren't given what we need in that moment to reconcile that disturbance. That's gratitude. So yes, Lisa, that's my answer.